Well, to prove a point, I have an Ultra pointed at my helmet. There it is on TV. I'm using the NVIDIA Shield, which is an Android TV console, and it has obviously Google Assistant built in. Now, in order to show you that this is real, I'm going to go ahead and take this and point it at my Raspberry Pi, and we'll watch for the latency. Arlo's well known for the latency. It's kind of a thing. It's what it does best. Boom. And of course we're in night mode. Now, um, this isn't an exact science. Obviously Arlo's love to forget uh, their cameras. The base station forgets stuff all the time. So let's go through a couple of other cameras. I have some regulars and I have some Pro 2s. Show camera P2 cars. Why is it P2 cars? Because it's a Pro 2 and it points down the stairs towards my cars. Okay, streaming P2 cars on Shield Android TV. Ta-da! Now, up there is an old original Arlo camera. It's just simply called cars. Show camera cars. Sure, streaming the cars on Shield Android TV. Now, it doesn't always work. I'll admit it. Sometimes it goes through this, and then I'll say smart home camera. Sometimes it works, sometimes it doesn't. I guess you just have to be patient. But if you are really interested in home security and you want to know if, say, someone was coming up those stairs towards the house, either to deliver food or do harm, they'll be at your front door uh, long before you get a notification. Um, obviously, this stuff has... You know, a good seven second delay sometimes, even up to 20 seconds. But, um, you know, that's neither here nor there. That's a topic for another day. But this is purely Android home, Android TV. Um, obviously, you just saw the Ultra. You have seen a P2. Now you're seeing a regular camera. Let me show you one in the backyard. I beg your pardon for this right now because it's covered in spider webs. Spiders love Arlo cameras for whatever stupid reason. So you're going to see mostly cobwebs. Maybe the spider, um, but you're not really going to see much else. Show P2 Backyard. Sure, streaming P2 Backyard on Shield Android TV. Now sometimes you'll see Smart Home Camera go across the screen, and sometimes when this stuff does not load, that's all I see. But as you can tell right now, the camera is covered in cobwebs. And who knows what our little spider buddy is up to tonight for dinner. He's probably snacking on something. We have these nice big orb weavers here in California. Anyway, um, so there's obviously a little spinner letting us know that there's a little bit of a lag. Let me show you another home integration. The only other third-party stuff that works is not Samsung. It's not the Honeywell Smart Thermostats. It's Casa by TP-Link. So I have it on living room lights. Turn on living room lights. There you go. You know, we're all frustrated with this stuff. It's intermittent, but I want to show it actually does work under a lot of different circumstances. Uh, it doesn't. It's really hit or miss. And I'll tell you, if you've gone this far in this video, let me give you a little nugget here. I've been trying this for the last two hours to show you that it works, but it's been so intermittent. I don't know what to tell you. Anyway, um, we're all frustrated, obviously, and I don't hinge, uh, you know, my, my security or, or even my sanity on home integration or even it showing up anywhere else. But it does not work on the phone. It does work on Android TV. Maybe it works on the Nest. Who knows? That's a topic for another day. Guys, you know, sorry if I was abrasive. Don't mean to be a jerk, but, you know, sometimes you got to you gotta chill out. And, uh, you know, just take it easy.